24 years sitting in the House of Lords, which is in itself a privilege, I've become convinced that I can play no further role in preventing my country sleepwalking into a disaster. I actually think that democracy is being chipped away at, chipped away at, chipped away at by a seemingly inexorable legislative process and that no one's really understood what's going on or how to stop it. In 1973, I co-produced two films, one called The Double-Headed Eagle, the other called Swastika, during which we unpicked exactly how Hitler had come to power. What frightens me is how many elements of that essentially Nazi playbook are emerging in terms of undermining and chipping away at our own very fragile democracy. What troubles me most about Britain is the fact that bit by bit, slowly, 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 uh, we are drifting into being a country that's accepting a diminished democracy. And if we continue to accept a diminished democracy, we might end up with a point at which there's a crisis where the, all those diminishings come together and we realize actually we have voted for what is effectively an autocracy. We are sleepwalking, we've got to wake up.